There is relief for some Victorians this morning after an emergency blaze was downgraded, but two others in the state's west remain out of control. Isabella Stashkovsky has the latest. Good morning to you. We know that conditions can change so rapidly, but for now it does seem that fire crews have got the upper hand and have got things in their grasp. We know that there was a fire in the west of the state of Dereal and that was burning at an emergency level. That's now been downgraded and brought under control. Two fires, though, are still out of control and they are at a watch and act level. One's near Geelong and the other is near Ballarat. Conditions did become uh, pretty scary at one point yesterday. We know that more than 30,000 people people uh, between Ballarat and Ararat, they were told that they should be leaving their properties and homes around those areas were lost. There were plenty of people though who chose to stay and defend their properties and businesses. We've got sprinklers on the roof, we've got our own fire truck, we've put in fire hydrants, much bigger concrete tanks which don't burn. My life is in the back of this transit van, yeah, I've got everything in there, like everything that is special to me and it means a lot to me. Walked around the house and thought if I start grabbing things, it'll never stop, so I just walked out again. Hopefully it'll be there when we get back. And as for the fire danger ratings right across the state, we know that yesterday it was extreme across half the state uh, and some areas in the Wimmera, they were told that extreme conditions, they could actually be at a catastrophic level. Today, uh, warnings right across Victoria are high and are moderate, so it's a much better situation for fire authorities.